and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Heimer Fate, our last donation deck of the day. So we're combining Twisted Fate and Heimerdinger, combining these two champions for our control deck where both of our champions are really powerful and can run away with the game. All sorts of uh, removal in here. Uh, for card draw, we have um, Black Market Merchant Pilfered Goods. We know how good that is. Uh, combination is and we're also going with three pick a cards now I usually like um, getting like permanent card draw that we get to keep in hand more than pick a card you know so something like um, salvage for example but pick a card is going to be important for us because it's a three mana spell like that's going to be really important and that's why we're you know we have our pick a cards we have our flash of brilliance get excited you need three mana spells for Heimerdinger and um, even though PNZ and uh, PNC and Bilgewater just don't do a very good job of protecting champions, there's basically no protection spells. Like suit up's the best one for these. Uh, hopefully, with our card advantage and with like the pick a card, we can still dig for more champions, even if uh, those go away. Our Zap Sprayfins should be pretty good. You know, drawing like these three mana spells. You know, Sprayfin can help find us Flash of Brilliance for Heimerdinger or get excited or pick a card. Um, you know, like we got lots of good things for it to hit. We're going one warning shot to, just to help out a little bit with the Black Market Merchant and the Pilfer Goods, um, help those out. Plus a warning shot's a really good card if you have a leveled up Twisted Fate. Uh, it does a really good job of getting you your uh, different color cards. But uh, I guess one last thing. Okay, camera refresh. One last thing is at the top end, there we go. Um, we have a Mind Meld, kind of a spicy one at the top end. Um, eight mana, slow speed. You know, sometimes we'll play a bunch of uh, spells and you know, maybe we'll make our things 10 tens, 15 fifteens. You know, you never know, especially with Heimerdinger going wide. Um, plus it's eight mana, which is a really good number for Heimerdinger because eight mana does make the 8-8, eight, eight, you know, it's, so it's better than playing 7 mana spells for sure. So 8 mana spell, important there. All right, so let's play some Heimer Fate. We'll go play 5 games over in Ranked. Yeah, and Mind Meld does have a great animation, so that gives that's a bonus there as well, getting that awesome animation as well. So we've had a good day of... Donation deck so far. I mean, this is going to be good too. All right, so we'll keep this. Look strong. I would say it's somewhere between strong to quite strong. Somewhere in there. We got the Bilge Water Board Mirror Match. Pass turn, please. Please, no one drop. Yes. We just want to hit him with Butcher, then play Merchant. Let's get to it. Which is a good reason to play. Jagged Butcher. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. That's a spicy one. Let's get a Rekindler in here. All right, so this is just gonna happen. Can't stop it. Um, could Mystic Shot that thing, but I'm just gonna pass and I'll just have Twisted Fate red card. Um, not only kill that, but then, yeah, but then also do a damage to them so that we'll have Filfer Goods available, no matter what. Never lost a fair game. Played one. Or played one. What is this? Transform an ally into a random five cost follower. Okay. Looks like trouble. I 
I thought they only had one mana left. Yeah, make it rain just is gonna wreck me. I thought they only had one mana left. I shouldn't have cast the pill for good. I should have held up Mystic Shot for that. I just, I, I missed that over there. I thought they were playing that with one mana. And then once I started making that attack, I saw they had two. So I guess I shouldn't have played Pilfer Goods. That's pretty awesome. Uh, it's a play trigger, not a summon trigger with your Kindler. I mean, if I just play Heimerdinger here, I'm taking a huge hit. The sweet smell of I think it's worth it, though. I think it's just better than any other option. So we're going to make this evolution turret, and then we're going to turn the evolution turret into a random 5 cost follower. And Twisted Fate does have more power than Heimerdinger, so we, we, we would be getting... Um, would be getting Twisted Fate. Pretty cool. I need to play some more of this card. Mystifying Magician. I need to play some more Mystifying Magician. I mean, for Meme Tier Monday. I don't know, is it worth killing this thing? Or should I just play Cythria? Maybe we can hit him with the pickpocket, maybe? Nope. Guess not. They're gonna block. Challenger 1-1. Oh, 
Alright, so I like it where we're at. You know, like we still have still have a twisted fate, still have a Heimerdinger. Got that spray fin. I'm not taking any more damage. And of course, you know, we want to be able to play these spells whenever we have a Heimerdinger in play. Ooh. That's not bad. Should I play Heimerdinger first and then Progress Day and then make an 8 8? Or do I just Progress Day, draw three, and then I can still play Sprayfin and still have a couple of mana? We should probably make an 8 8. Eight eights are good. Mind meld. Oh no, opponent surrendered. Didn't get to mind meld. All right, good start. Good start, good win. We get to stay at 10-14. Should see what we're actually at whenever we get paired. Yeah, GG's, that was a good game. Definitely had a really good start, you know, having turn two uh, Black Market Merchant turned on, definitely a good start in that game. 10-15, we lost a rank. We won in, I don't know, the ranking thing's bugged. It's bugged, I tell ya. Bugged. Uh, we'll get rid of the Flash of Brilliance. And get rid of Jagged Butcher. I don't know, maybe even Pickpocket. Like, they just have like a bunch of like little things that are like good at blocking and everything. I'll keep Pickpocket though. I mean, pickpocket just trades here. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, I should have kept the Jagged Butcher. That's right. I was thinking, I'm just so used to playing against the Freljord one. Yeah, this is the, no the Noxus version. Right, so I probably should have just kept that Jagged Butcher. At least right now, Jagged Butcher doesn't look like it would really be doing anything. You know, like it can't can't trade with a two two one unless they block. It doesn't do anything against Crimson Disciple. Gotcha. It's not really gotcha when you spend four mana to kill a two two, or sorry, a two mana card. It's not really a gotcha. So much damage. Everyone's a garden. <clears throat> I mean, we just kind of ha like we take two from the Crimson Disciple, but we just kind of have to do this and get rid of the saplings. Gonna be difficult for us to stabilize. 
Well, that's not ideal. Something for all. So I can either we're at eight. Either thermal jack beam this thing for two or steal two cards. Uh, it's unlikely we're gonna turn on that pill for goods another time, so I'm gonna just use that right now. Okay, so good blockers. Does it not even? Okay, there it tells you two. Okay, so it's just so spells, not spells, and so yeah, this is just spells. It's not you know like this is that's a unit. Doesn't count. Doesn't count units. Just count spells. That transfusion is bad news. Good draw. Good draw. This one you can call a gotcha. We could say gotcha here. Gotcha. Okay, no removal for Heimerdinger. Those are not bad. Wish this Flash of Brilliance still cost three. Can we stabilize? We don't have any life gain. So like our, our eight life is all we got. We gotta finish the game and put them down to 15 before, ugh, before we take six. We have some burn. Our hand. Ooh. True shot barrage, anyone? Three, two, one. We're about to play this mind meld. I think 
we're turning this corner. Um, so we could go black market merchant plus pilfered goods. Um, or I could just go jagged butcher pilfer goods. Now yeah, let's go. Okay. You something. Nice, we took a decimate off the top. That's important. You know that we can play Mind Meld? Maybe not. Alright, they surrendered. Yeah, I guess it's probably good. We had to just go, just go to attacks. Could have let them have another Decimate. And, uh... So I wasn't, I was not going to, yeah, so I was going to hold up my get excited because of Noxion Fervor, right? So I, like I was going to be able to get excited their thing in response to a Noxion Fervor, but yeah, Decimate. Decimate would have been scary if they had another one. Okay, 2-0. Oh. Getting that value. Yeah, feeling good so far, for sure. Um, you know, stealing cards is pretty powerful. Ooh. Oh man, I wish we had the attack token turn two for this pickpocket. So get excited is not something I want early. Like I don't want to discard any of these like with my get excited. I have, if they have a lease, I have pickpocket. So we're fine there. Uh, we'll keep merchant because it's just so powerful. But we may not be able to turn it on. Uh, double Heimerdinger. Not the best. I wish I was attacking turn two for this thing. But maybe their plan is Remembrance. You know, they are a Lux deck. Maybe they just have nothing. Take from the rich, give to me. And their plan's Remembrance. And then we get to hit them with this and then play Merchant. That would be great if they pass if, and we actually get to connect with Pickpocket. That would be great. Hit them. Get Unyielding Spirit. All right, I guess I'll take single combat. Not a bad one. Brood Awakening. That is much better for me than... Yeah, like, that's better for me because of Twisted Fate Red card. Does mean that I'm taking six here if they just go straight to attacks. Or two. Something for all. <clears throat> so it would have been greedy to go blue card to get the other spell mana and then be able to have Heimerdinger, Flash of Brilliance. That would have been pretty greedy. So they're going to challenge here. Okay, no, they're not doing that. Maybe our black market merchant hits them. Then I can play another one. Or we could just drop Heimerdinger. So 
So better to just draw Heimerdinger. Mayhaps. Dang. Control the mage to control. Last of how many guys. Control the mage. It's just all Heimerdingers and Mage Seeker investigators. My most groundbreaking invention to date. <laughs> They attack and kill everything. This back to back is going to be good. It's all dead. Attacks, or let's see. If I go unlicensed innovation, then you know we make a five-five and a six-one overwhelm. It's probably better than what they do. Like let's see, let's say I do that, then they play Lux. Um, then I attack in. They can block like the five-five. Don't it's just seven damage right now. No, let's let's do it. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna be progressing day. That's for sure. No. No. Oh well. Dealt more damage to him. By just a little bit. We dealt four additional damage, but then they also gained three life. They're probably gaining that three life anyway. Come closer. I don't bite. I don't believe you. Got more Heimerdingers. Let's try to get rid of the lease. Okay, good. Gotcha. Just go straight to attacks. Feels like... Feels like an alright play to me. Put an end to magic. Withering Whale. Whale. That's not cool. Alright. We'll keep playing. 
A longer game is probably good for us anyway. Spend four mana on Gotcha next turn instead of just the two. Oh well. Need to do some damage to them. Ooh, Mystic Shot can do some damage to them. And then I can have double Pilfer Goods. And have everything cost less. Could detain, but doesn't seem to make much sense. Yeah, one mana pill for goods, because two two mana was too much. Couldn't handle the two mana. Sure. Alright, I guess we don't get to don't get to have them cost less. We got two detains, so they can't do anything with. Yeah, Metal World Gaming is the streamer who plays, who only plays Heimer Vi. They do a wonderful job of that over there. Yeah, Meta World Gaming. Good dudes. Uh, let's see. And they they've start they've they played like some other decks and stuff too. They have some good like uh, um they have some good YouTube com content too. For those of y'all watch on YouTube, check out uh, Meta World Gaming. Uh, uh, you think I should pick a card? Yeah, maybe. Alright, they decided they were done playing. So once I Mystic Shot them, I you know the game is going the wrong way for them. All right, Heimer Faith, three and O. Oh. That was big, hitting them with the Kempunk pickpocket. Um, again, turning on Black Market Merchant. Uh, we've done that a couple of times, turn on the Black Market Merchant earlier, it's been really good. But yeah, the, the pickpocket gave us that single combat. That single combat was a pretty nice spell for us. Ooh, Jinx Twisted Faith. Some Jinx Twisted Fate. Um, I mean, Spray Fin's good, but I want I want something earlier. Early stuff. Okay. Pickpocket's good. I get to attack with Pickpocket on turn two. I like it. All right, let's go pick a pocket. Pick a pocket full of sorrow. No, no. Save me, Luke. What does he say? He says like, save me. It always sounds like save me, Lucian. Or like Luke. Give it a whirl. What is he saying there? Oh, I got the kids. Um, I haven't had as much success with the Lucian Callista Sacrifice deck. It, it's, it's, I think the metagame's a little fast for it. It's good, it's, it's better in the slower metagame, and there's, before, and there's a lot of people playing control. I think that's better for that deck. Loot. Okay. Save me loot. I like the loot. That he gets. 
What did we get? Save me, loot. What did we get? I'm always up for a round or two. So if they twisted fate me back, they can go gold card and kill the pickpocket. I hope. I mean, I hope not. You know, I hope they just have something lame. Darn. Darn. So they're up a card. We're both Twisted Fates in play. I got four, they got five. Because I spent one additional card to take out their uh, slot bot. Looks like trouble. And I want to... Definitely want to play a spell with Heimerdinger, right? Like, I don't want to just play a naked Heimerdinger. It dies. I get no value from it. Yeah, no, miss. Alright, they didn't miss. Awesome, Mod. You had a good good nap. Ah, uh, that was my mystic shot. Cause they don't they don't these cards don't change spots, so they, they took my mystic shot there. Hmm. Could just Mystic Shot them and then pull for goods. This is a real spin to win. Guess I'm doing that. Definitely wish I had one more mana and I could have just progressed aid. It's not looking great for us right now. We're behind in play and on the board. Ship recorder. I don't think they like that I stole some cards from them. Even though they're playing the same cards themselves. I'm sorry, Mind Meld. You're gonna get discarded. Did they discard another Get Excited? Did they just discard a Get Excited? When I'm at... I mean, I guess I'm at 14. Oh no, they discarded the warning shot. This warning shot's gone. Never mind. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. Stop. Yes, they missed. I assume that was my flash of brilliance. I assume that was also my flash of brilliance. I don't. I assume that their deck does not have flash of brilliance, but you never know. What are the odds they make Heimerdinger's turrets cost one next patch? Not very good. I'd probably say ten percent. Ten percent chance. No! Two pilfered goods? <laughs> that's such a good card! Oh, that's such a good card! 
Ugh. But see, I want so I want to do this before I start drawing to look for more treasures. So we want to find these treasures. scary. That's scary. Never lost a fair game or played one. Something for all. I'm always up for a round or two. Or two. A red card I'm back. So Mystic Shot kills this. Stop. They're gonna take my treasures. They better not take my treasures. It was pretty it was pretty silly how my opponent was doing like the emote of like them being really mad when I was taking stuff when they're playing <laughs> they're playing the the steel cards also. That was pretty silly. There's this twisted fate's already four? They've just played it, it's already four out of eight. Just drew eight they just drew four cards. Like, maybe I need a Mystic Shot this thing. It's already 5 out of 8 now. Shuffle. I probably need to kill the Jinx. I can't block that thing. Killing the Jinx, can't block it. Why is Black Market Merchant not? I guess they don't want me to block that. We are drawing four cards this next turn. I'm just hoping I find something that kills Twisted Fate and four cards. Which could be another Twisted Fate, could go another red card. Do I have a mana to play all these? I can have 13 mana. Yes, I do. I want to have the information of what we draw first before we cast Get Excited. Twisted Fate with the rummage. This game's heating up. Pretty crazy card draw they had with that, you know, being able to still have Pilfer Goods, Rummage, Rummage, Black Market Merchant. Is that our first Twisted Fate to kill? Like, do they have two more? Round and round it goes. Now, 
I do have two more. A game. Go on, yeah, I want to draw a treasure or... Um, or the progress day that we put back. That's what we want to draw, one of those two things. Treasure or progress day. Dang. Well, that's all their pilfer goods, because we, we know that I, I I tossed my pilfer goods, unfortunately. Yeah, this, this has got to be over, right? Them having all of these cards. If I block Heimerdinger dies. Interesting solution. Yeah, it's going to die to red card, gold card. Yep, it's going to die anyway. Yeah, hope they didn't steal my treasures. We do need some crazy treasure value. No reason to play this thing. If they want to just pass turn and all those fleeting cards that they just drew and get rid of them, that's fine with me. Um, what do I think should be nerfed and buffed? Um, I honestly don't think they have to do very much right now. I think it's just a really healthy metagame. I think there's so much good stuff. Um... That was my black market merchant. I mean, I, I think the I think it's the meta game is like really, um, really even, pretty across the board. Uh, I think they did a great job the last time. As far as buffed, I mean, Anivia, Anivia is like not <laughs> Anivia. We talked about this the other day. It sounds silly to say, but Anivia could could cost five mana as it is right now. They could just reduce the cost by two, and it still wouldn't really see play. And I, I know that sounds that sounds ridiculous at first, um, but you know, like we discussed it the other day. The more you really think about it, it's just not um, it's not good enough even at five mana. It's like that card and Brom. Those two Freljord champions, like Trindamir, Darius, yeah, like some of the, like those original champions, could buff up some. All right, deal five to all units. We got our treasures. And now we're gonna make three eight eights. Keep up, keep up. And hope the three eight eights. This card is, is silly. I don't like this card really. Like three eight eight fearsomes. Like they just shouldn't have fearsome, or they shouldn't just be. They should be like two twos that turn into five fives or something. This card's pretty silly. The 
There we go. The treasures. <laughs> he said, where are your emotes now, opponent? Yeah, they were... They were pretty confident they were going to be winning that, I think. I think their attack the turn before, how they went straight to attacks, I think that was a really poor attack. I think they could have, uh, you know, played some spells and killed my things and not let me block and play some other things out and dealt more damage to me. And probably, probably killed me or closer to it. All right, plan versus burn. Good hand versus burn. I'll keep it even. I don't usually like keeping get excited in my opener, as y'all know, but I'll keep it here um, because we may need it um, to kill like a, a, a Crimson Disciple or a Boom Crew Rookie. May just need it and um, you know, we'll discard like this, pick a card. I was about to go because I didn't think you could win that, but I got to stay for the five win dream. That's right, five win dream. We are so close. Right, we're clearing some stuff out. So I could go Twisted Fate red card and it kills that. But I'm just going to go Zap Sprayfin instead. Save my Twisted Fate red card. Because Teemo can't really get through Sprayfin anyway. Um... And so now Twisted Fate red card can kill some more stuff. I just want to make sure they didn't like Transfusion. I don't know. No, don't go to attacks. No! I did not want them to go to attacks. Uh, man, I really want them to play something. I go to as a fate red card. Uh, so this will be uh, six damage me down to 13 and then if I play this I have two extra mana so I can't respond to like a noxion fervor or something if I block here I still take six then I take an additional four May just do the rest of the damage. Um, you know, noxion fervors and stuff like that. Okay, that's fine. I'll take that. That's not a, like that's good for me. I think that's not a mystic shock doing damage to me. I think that's good. Boy. 
Looks like they're blocking with Teemo. Maybe? No, I just got two of those. All right, so eight damage puts him down to 11. Better run. Yuck. I'm gonna have to use a gotcha. On Teemo, it looks like it. I'll be discarding the pick a card to get excited. You know, like we don't want to draw more cards with like these puff caps. Ugh. Well. Fortunate, but worth it. Remember the objectives. War Mason, reporting. Okay, down to six. What do we get? That would have been a great time to hit uh, True Shot Barrage. Yeah, definitely glad they didn't draw a Crimson Disciple. You know, out of, out of like those two cards. Oh, <laughs> Crimson Disciple is just a little too late. Okay, Decimate. Um, I can't really block this Crimson Disciple though. That, like, that thing's doing two damage to me because this is a, uh, you know, we have a one-two and a two-two. Dang. This puts me down to one. This attack here. I guess I probably have to pilfer goods. Cause I don't think I can. I don't, yeah, I can't progress day. That's just too risky with these puff caps. I think I try to take a spell from them. Okay, at least... At least I'm not taking two from Crimson Disciple now. So we'll keep... We'll keep Boom Crew Rookie alive. Both at three. Is that all? Come on, burn spell. That's a burn spell. You do this right away. Get the get the two damage in for you know. Like I don't want to play Twisted Fate first, and then they kill my Boomku rookie. Huh. So that's just game. They just, yeah, they just kill themselves. I'm always up for a round or two. And that'll be it. That's a 5-0. No the rare 5-0. So close. They were so close, the uh... Alright, got that elusive 5-0 with Heimer Fate. So awesome, awesome day just with uh, donation decks here. You know, like we did really well um, with with all of our decks. Uh, so yeah, all, all like new decks that, you know, are, are completely under the radar because they're decks y'all submitted. Um, but yeah, they all went, all went really well today. Even, you know, even the Swain Control was pretty sweet, even though we just went 2-3 with that one. Um, but Katarina Lux was awesome. Ash Harrowing, man, that Ash Harrowing was so close to a 5-0. Um, my opponent had some crazy stuff to to that one game they won. Ash Harrowing looked really good. And now, um, yeah, Heimer Fate. Definitely, yeah, just it went really well. You know, I like like how low to the ground we were. Um, you know, nice uh, nice curve here. Being able to beat being able to beat Burn with a deck like this. 
pretty impressive. Um, so yeah, it all it all worked out. We got we definitely got really lucky game four. We got super lucky game four with those two treasures, like the two perfect treasures uh, to win that one. We didn't have much of a chance there, but we got very lucky in that game. Um, and uh, yeah, even just that last game getting getting the burn opponent. That's a tough one. All right, so that's Heimer Fate, uh, the 5-0 dream. And that, um, those of y'all watching on YouTube later on, definitely hit that like button over here for this 5-0. And uh, feel free to leave those comments. I always love those comments. You know, let me know which decks you really liked today. Um, you know, all that kind of stuff. Um, um, yeah, maybe we could be onto something with this deck. I mean, Heimerdinger is awesome. Twisted Fate is awesome. Uh, if you have your, your cards line up, you can beat anybody. Um, you know, Pickpocket looked really good. I think I just think this is a really underrated card, Kempunk Pickpocket, and it definitely looked really good getting us some free spells in some of those games. All right, but anyway, that's Heimer Fate. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.